2005 for lacking international maritime standards. MV Pamba underwent rehabilitation and is now back on the waters. The rehabilitation of MV Pamba is estimated to have cost Mango Tree Group Limited 28.6 billion Ugandan shillings, with the capacity to carry 22 wagons worth 10,000 tons of cargo. The recommissioned vessel will be plying across Port Bell, Jinja Port, Port Mwanza, and Port Kisumu, doing an average of 12 voyages per month. Water transport is one of the cheapest and safest mode of transport, but which we have not fully exploited. Our Lake Victoria is just here for us. It's there. Fresh waters, God gave us. But we are not yet fully utilizing its potential. On 18th May 2020, a memorandum of understanding was signed between government and Mango Tree Group Limited to carry out rehabilitation, upgrade, class insure and commission the vessel at its own cost. We are looking forward uh, to working with the, uh, me, uh, the Ugandan government in investing uh, more on uh, transport uh, for the benefit of the people around the Lake Victoria Basin. As the ministry builds an efficient transport sector, Ugandans need to safeguard all established infrastructure. It's a lot of money has been invested. We have heard the, the MD talking about how many how much money has been invested, how much money has been borrowed. Please stop the ir irresponsible acts of vandalizing these facilities. The business community is optimistic on using the cheaper water transport tariffs that will apply to the vessel. Even if we are thinking about adding value in a country, but to export 10 million bags of coffee, just for, as an example, there is no way we can cope without Uganda Railways Corporation and without utilizing these vessels. We in private sector, when the infrastructure is right, then it leaves us in the business community to use that infrastructure to create more jobs, to make more money and to make our country very habitable. MV Pamba is a vessel owned by government and operated by URC on Lake Victoria. Through the MOU, Mango Tree Group Limited was licensed to run its operations till it recovers all its costs. Wadulo Makanold, UBC News, in Port Bell, Luzira.